Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. So this is kind of just again once of your generic once again one of your generic discussion and rant type videos, but this does have a core center to it. Like most of the time. Um have you guys ever had a moment in your life where the moment will happen, a certain, a certain level of time would bypass, and you look back on the moment and you would wonder either what would have happened if I chose the opposing route, or I wish I could just take that back and redo it or reword it, depending on the circumstance. This particular situation actually happens to me a lot. So, all of us have demons inside of us. Mine? I guess because in my past I've been so optimistic of a person, took a very long time to get to me. And once they did, though, let's just say... Bear in mind, I'm the kind of person who looks at circumstances and tries to take realistic logic uh, or reasoning into consideration but once in a blue moon you'll find a circumstance where this logic or reason doesn't really match up with reality a good example of this is actually when I used to live with my parents I'm sure they went through a lot of that so future um in for my parents if you do if mom dad if you do see this in the future what i'm talking about here yeah it's going to be done it's I, that's definitely crossed my mind where it's like i wish i could go back replay that and or at least revisit that time and reword it or reenact re react it to it differently than at what actually played out the funny thing about like wanting to retract and replace something like that is that it happens a lot with me and i'm sure there are hundreds of thousands of maybe millions of people out there i don't know Maybe some of you who were watching this have experienced this before. Um, where you see that and that's what you think. But if you were to change that, what of what you currently have would change? For me, I don't want anything to change. I don't know how much of like these past events that I'm referring to impacted what's going on in my life now. At least not as a whole. Not until I really started paying attention to it, which I would say probably over the past three or four years that's been the case, maybe less, but if I were to reenact or recreate with different outcomes of these things, how would it change? certain circumstances that either have already happened or are bound to happen. Would it change any of them? That's a question that, I mean, a lot of theories out there talk about don't alter the past or it could drastically change the future. Sci-fi says that, but it's not like anybody's time traveled in reality before. However, it does make me question. The events that come into fruition, whatever they may be, or whatever they were, or just, you know, whatever they are, depending on when it's happening. Maybe there's something at the end of that little rabbit hole that you're unaware of yet that just might be important more important than you might think. A lot of the times nowadays, if this were to happen, it's happened amongst me and some of my past uh, workplace bosses before. Thank heavens not recently, but even still, um, I've gone into work and I, I had these kind of 
argument or disagreements, depending on how you look at the word. I would call it an argument, but you know. Said arguments le led to eventually me working or towards what I am now. But if they never happened, what would be different? Well, maybe there's a chance I never would have left the workplace in the first place. Because a lot of the times when I do leave a workplace, it's usually because of the management is so bad it's unbearable. Now, if it's just, and I mean unbearable for me. This is a great example of what I'm talking about. Because, I don't know. Say, there, there are a lot of examples. I'm trying to think of the right examples. The right, more thought-provoked relatable example, but I can't really think of anything off the fly. Bear in mind, once again, this is not scripted. These never are. But the factor of simply just that of, like, wanting to go back to revisit events that have happened that you wish you could rerun through just to change, whether slightly or a lot, well, how is it impacting everything at the current moment? A good example of this is, well, it was a long, it's a long haul example, but there was a point in time in the past where I don't remember the exact details of what I happened. I just, all I remember is I did something to hurt my mom. I don't remember what it was or how it happened, but being the 12 year old, I think, I think I was like 12 at the time, um, incompetent kid that I was, I ran out and around. I was planning, I was wanting to talk to mom and she was crying. I think, and I would imagine it was because she was hurt. I wouldn't imagine it was because she was. And you know what? I was to blame. Trying to think back on it just makes me more devoted now or motivated now to try to do what I can to look around, analyze, and do whatever I can to prevent stuff like that from happening. It lingers over my shoulder every every time I think about it. Sure, it's so far in the past that it may not seem to matter in the now, but the reality of it is, if I never upset her to begin with, well, I probably wouldn't be the fluent person I am. Because quite frankly, the kind of kid I was, I did upset my parents a lot. Like, and that's an understatement. But if I never did act that way and I actually got more disciplined, I probably wouldn't be the person I am now, personality-wise. Probably be a lot more strict and or stern. I would probably, quite frankly, I probably wouldn't be doing this YouTube stuff. I guess in a way, my parents are the first individuals to actually push me unknowingly to become the person I am now. And they have messaged me before that I seem very different. I'm not the person I was. Well, on that front, I would say that's a good thing. I think that's what they... I don't remember exactly, but I think that's what they... I don't think they had, like, a particular... When they said that to me, I don't think it was a case of whether good or bad. It was just an analysis saying, yeah, you're not who you used to be. Whether that's good or bad is kind of irrelevant, but I take it at this point as kind of a good thing. 
because who I used to be was, let's just say it was bad enough to where I don't like to talk about it. <clears throat> who I used to be is kind of where, thinking about who I used to be is kind of what triggered this topic in the first place. If I were to go back, how much would I want to change? But if I did change it, how much would it change what's going on now? How would it change who I am? Or even who I end up with? And if I did end up with the same person, how would it change the relationship we have? So we have a great relationship. I mean, sure, she's gone a lot of the time, and I'm home, and I'm gone a lot of the time, and she's home, but that's kind of normal, actually. But we'll save that for a different day. That is something I do want to discuss at some point. But outside of that, when we are together, it's great. There are some learning things that we end up experiencing together. Whether she learns or I learns really depends on the circumstance and what's going on. And when that's not the case, we derp around to the point where she tries to tickle one of my four very sensitive spots. And for the most part, gets away with it. So with that example given... In my mind, if I were able to change things from the past, the bad things, would I? Realistically, no. I wouldn't. Because it would change me as the it would change the person I am today. Sure, I've got some flaws. I'm willing to admit that. No, most of those flaws come from communication issues but even then that's that's kind of what domino affects all the other like bad aspects it's all connected to that what about all the good all that good the good aspects about me which I'm not going to list because I don't want to sound self absorbed probably wouldn't be there I would probably be an entirely different person. And I don't want that. I like who I am. I love who I am. I don't like every detail that happens to my life. It depends on the point in time, really. If you rewind far back on the channel, you'll kind of see what I'm talking about. You have to go pretty far back at this point, but... I've had some pretty heavy hiccups over the course of the past five, ten years. But personality-wise, and especially recently, I don't think I'd be the person I am, and I'm, I don't want to know that, whether I would be or not. I like things the way they are. And because of that factor, I do question why others want to go back to change things so poor, badly. Because the reason I gave the example of myself, yeah, may have said or done bad things, but rather than trying to go back in time and reminisce, or if it was possible, fix and change it, why not simply just look back see what analyze what you did or said and hold on to that as a thought for future reference to help you progress to help you do what you need to do to grow as a person But that's just kind of how I feel about this. 
many people I'm sure are very, very, very different than I when it comes to that particular topic, but I don't know. How about you guys? Have you ever try have you ever gotten to a point where you wish you could change things from the past? Let us know in the comments below. If you'd like to check out any other discussion rant type videos that have been done on this channel, click the link on the side of my head over here where um, you'll find several different topics at this point. Some of them are kind of outdated, others aren't, depends on the topic. Click the link on this side. If that's not quite floating your boat, you're still here and you want to check out something on the channel that may hit a bit easier for you or might be more appealing to you. In the meantime, I'm going to head off. Thanks again for tuning into this video, guys. And let me reach in for my mouse because I kind of need my mouse. With that being said, I'm going to head off, but we hope to see you guys in another video. Catch you guys later.